Welcome back to the Dragon Quest walkthrough. This is episode nine. Nine. Yeah, nine. So, I am exactly left off from where I was. Where I was. And actually, I'm going to save this moment. Very smart to do. Nothing has happened since then. I have not leveled up off screen. I have not gotten anything, but this time we will be going to an. A different area now, now that we're done with the first quest. Completely done with it. So now that I saved, here we go. Oh, cool. oh I probably should have had how much XP I had. If you go to divination, it gives you an XP kind of walkthrough. Shows you how much XP you need to the next level. Kind of useful since there's no other way to check it. And now I am going to sell some stuff. I need money for the next town I'm going to. There's a lot of good stuff there. Make sure that they're... Okay, I've already gotten the best stuff here. So, bye-bye bandana. And... Goodbye copper sword. Okay, that's a lot of money for for this far in the game. It's quite a bit. And now, pay attention, because we'll show you how to get to the next city called Alexandria. And cutscene again, I guess, kind of. Seth, what happened? What did you do? They explain the story. The intro it is shot. What? Domegas killed Master Nidus? The same Domegas we're looking for? That fiend killed his own teacher? And you say he headed south? Then there's no time to lose. We must go after him at once. Let's be on our way. Okay. Let's go to the end. Oh, oops, stuck on something. Of course, battles, battles, battles. I do just love battles. Love battles. Battles are helpful. Oh, critical hit first. Hit. Nice. Good way to start off. I will give a monster debrief, debrief as well. So you just want to follow this path, like, like so, going to the waterfall cave. But before you get there, approximately right here, see a sign and a fork left. You go left. Just follow this path the whole time, basically. And then you get pointless battles like these. They help you no way, no how. Because they won't even level you up anymore. Slimes at this point are kind of worthless because you can one hit them easily, and if you were to distribute the damage, you could probably kill two of them. Oh, 
Oh, it's getting dark. Okay, well, during nighttime can get annoying, so the monsters will be a little bit harder, but I have to deal with it. Yeah, these are kind of useless too, because I can one hit KO them. You should be able to also. If you're not, you're, you're probably a little bit off. You should be doing about 14, anywhere from 10 to 15 damage should be about normal. If you're my level at least. But then when you get right here, that red, that orange tree right in front of me, that's actually used for something. But, uh, if, I'll do side quests later, so. In this place that I'm going to, it is the new region. There will be new monsters across this bridge. Some of them, which were in the waterfall cave, there will be more too. Just because it's a new region. But if you, if you try to go here during the during the the Farber request with the with the waterfall cave, you can't. This this gate is shut. And you want to get this chest or pair right after you cross the bridge. Beetle boys, beetle boys. They come out at night. Um, they have quite a bit of defense, so you gotta watch out for that. They will knock you down occasionally, too, so it kind of wastes one turn. And they do... I think... Yeah, they do a lot of damage, quite a bit. Quite hard, but still beat him. Lots of XP. Good for the soul. Slimy rings. Okay, slimy rings. I'm going to equip them to. Let's see. Okay. Yangus, because he has lower defense. You just want to follow the path. The path goes straight up to the city. The city is just right up here. And... Okay, Barton Archer. Barton Archer is really simple. He can get annoying because he will shoot his arrows at you. And his arrows approximately do 4 damage, I think. But I'll say they're not that hard. I would focus concentration on the Beetle Boy first, but... 3 damage. Okay. See, they're not that hard. And goodbye. Oh, level up. Yeah, 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 level up. Yes, attack power increases by 5 when having an axe. Okay, that's good. Alright, the city is just up here where this gate is. So, actually, put holy water so I can show you. I'll worry about leveling up later off screen. Yay, disappearance. Okay. I only have a few seconds left, so I'll just.